So today's word is an interesting one. Today's word is oasis. And that's actually what I am attempting to create in this space that I work in. So you'll see that I actually have plants behind me. These are live plants. I didn't buy these at Home Depot. They are not plastic. They are actually living. And there's a reason why I wanted living plants in this environment because this is an environment where I teach, and this is also an environment where I learn. This is an environment where I encourage others to grow as I am growing. And when we think about the word oasis and we think about what it means, an oasis is a fertile spot in a desert, and it's a place where you find water. It's the place where you find refreshing in an environment that's dry, in an environment where nothing is growing. An oasis is the one place where you can be refreshed, where you can be renewed. And if you think about your life, if you think about those situations that maybe feel dry, those situations that maybe feel like a desert, what is the oasis that you go to that actually brings sustenance to your life? What is the fertile spot in your life where there is growth, where there is water, where there is refreshing? Do you have that in your life? And if you don't, I encourage you to find it. One of the things that can happen in life is that we look so much at the desert around us that we can't identify where the oasis is. I'm going to link to a document in the description box. And when you download this document, I want you to look at 12 areas of your life. And you're going to see some areas where things look deserted. You're going to see some areas where things just look dry, but you're also going to see some areas where things are looking really good. You're going to be able to pinpoint what the oasis is in your life. And I want you to lean into that, not only to look at how you can develop the areas in your life that may be dry and desolate, but how you can also treasure those areas where your life is being refreshed and renewed this is so important. We're not only called to pinpoint the problems and to look at the problems in our life, but we're also called to pinpoint and to celebrate those areas where life is good. So I want to encourage you to do that today. Celebrate where there is an oasis in your life. Lean into that, pull from that so that you can go on to water the desert, whatever that looks like for you. Whatever that desert looks like for you, there is enough water in your oasis to keep you going and to keep you moving forward towards your vision. I hope this helps. Blessings on your journey. And I will talk to you very soon. Bye.